Hi friends, happy Magical Monday. Hey lovey subbies, how are you doing? I have not seen you guys in two weeks. It's been crazy, it's been insane, but I'm so glad to be back um, doing the last Magical Monday of 2019. I can't believe we're already gonna be in a new year, it's crazy. So I've been missing for the past two weeks because I had pneumonia. I'm still recovering from it. Um, I still have the sniffles and I have a cough still. I might cough during this video, so I apologize up front. I better not laugh too much because laughing sometimes triggers the coughing. And then I start hacking the bits. But I was in my bed. I was so exhausted. My chest was exhausted. Um, I just was not doing good, but I am glad that I'm doing much better now. I'm getting back to normal. After this week, I'll probably be at 100%, which I hope, hopefully, but while I was gone, I hope you guys were doing okay. If you're feeling kind of yucky and sick, I hope you're getting better and you're not doing too bad. So while I was gone... I got a couple new things in my life. Okay, first of all, I want to share her with you guys. <gasps> this cute doll I got at CVS because I had to get my medicine. It is a wispy walker doll. She walks when you hold her hand. I love these dolls. I did not know that they still made them. I know they were like huge in the 60s. And I have some vintage uh, dolls over there. I think I've shared them with you guys that I absolutely love. Play Pal type dolls that are adorable, and I wish they were still super popular, but you know, children don't really like toys anymore. Um, but I seen her there, and I just had to have her. She's super, super cute and adorable, um, and she's made by the Unita Doll Company, which I had no idea that they were still making dolls, um, but I guess they are, and they come out during the holiday season and like they're sold at CVS, which is totally crazy to me, but so super adorable. So I love her cute little outfit. She has underoos on, which is nice. And they also sold extra fashion packs and shoe packs for these guys, which was really, really amazing if you want to change them and all that stuff. But I did not get any um, of the clothes or clothing or shoe packs. I don't know why. I just really love her outfit and I'm going to keep her in this. And she's super, super cute and adorable. And because she is a wispy walker, I named her Wispy. And um, she, her eyes open and close and she's super, super adorable. So I had to share her with you guys because I absolutely love her. I love you, Wispy. You're so cute. I love really, really huge dolls. I think they are adorable. And play dolls are my favorite. And then I got this huge Ad Indominus Rex because I love Jurassic Park. <laughs> and I really, really love the dinosaurs and the action figures for Jurassic World and then the Jurassic Park action figures. And I'm just in love with it. I feel like an eight-year-old boy. <coughs> and he roars and does all that crazy stuff. And I absolutely love him. Um... And like this time of year, it's so hard not to buy toys because they have such great sales. But anyway, I'm glad to be back. It is Magical Monday. I like to, you know, share a little Disney magic at the beginning of the week. And it is the last Magical Monday ever on the Sally Hearts Track 80 show because as we go into the new year, I will be doing a new format um, that'll just be a one day a week show. Um, which will still be on Monday, but um, every Monday I'm going to switch it up and do something different on the channel. But anywho, this Disney stuff that I'm going to share with you today is super, super cute and super way adorable. And I got it as a surprise from my parents. My parents are so awesome and amazing, not because they get me surprises, but because they, you know, um, are there for me and they are a great support system for me and I absolutely adore them. So when they surprise me with gifts out of the blue, I absolutely love it because they always seem to know what to get me and I am a huge fan of this movie. It's one of my favorite Disney films and I adore it and I'm talking about The Hunchback of Notre Dame and I love that my parents got me these cute, adorable, 
Funko Pops. There's Esmeralda. And then there is Quasimodo in his festival a fool's outfit, which is adorbs. Even though that scene in the movie makes me super, super sad and I cry um, when I watch it. Okay, there, I said it. I cried during The Hunchback. <laughs> but um, it's really, really cute. There's the art on the box and it says Quasimodo fool. And it is super, super cute. Oops, uh-oh, I'm having a dinosaur catastrophe over here. Hold on, guys. And then on the back of the box, there are the three in the series. You get Esmeralda, regular Quasimodo, and then Festival of Fo Fools Quasimodo, which is adorable. He does not come with the little plastic disc stand, but he could stand on his own because he has, you know, really, really big feet. I'm not going to remove him from the box because I don't want to. I like that the box is in really, really great condition. And sometimes I like to keep my pops in their box, uh, their boxes, because they're adorable. So there's Quasi. And then here's Esmeralda. She comes with her tab tambourine. And there she is on the box. There she is on the side. I love the box art. It's so adorable. She has the same thing on the back as Quasimodo does. And she does come with the little plastic disc to stand her on. And I love that they come with that. So that way, um, you know, when you pull them out of the box, if you pull them out of the box, you have a little stand to make sure she doesn't fall over. Because the pops, you know, they got really, really big heads. And sometimes they fall over. But she is adorable. I love all the detail in her um, outfit and everything. Hopefully you guys can see that without all the glare. Um, and I love the hunchback. And I like, I gotta get Quasimodo in his regular form. But I love this one because he's smiling and he's super, super happy. And it looks like in his regular form, he's kind of got a sad face. Which is really, really sad. But Quasimodo, you know, he had a tough little life. But I'm glad he met Esmeralda because he got to learn about friendship. And I really, really love that movie. I have not watched it in a while because it gives me the feels every time I watch it. So I try not to watch it too much, but I do absolutely love it. And I do have my um, Hunchback Dolls from when the movie came out, when Mattel came out with their Esmeralda, Phoebus, and Quasimodo. Back when Mattel made really, really good Disney dolls. So I absolutely love that. So I had to share these with you guys. They are adorable. Do you guys love The Hunchback of Notre Dame? Do you collect pops? Let me know in the comments down below because pretty soon you guys won't be able to leave comments for me because YouTube stinks. Um, but um, while you can, I would love to hear from you guys. And um, let me know in the comments down below what you've been up to for the past couple of weeks. Did you get anything new and exciting to add to your collection? And um, what, have, what have you been doing? Have you been out shopping? Have you been on a little bit of a vacation? Um, oh, sorry. My, this cute little dinosaur, he has like the chomping action. Love him. Anywho, um... So yeah, I mostly have not been doing anything because like I said, I've been wiped out. <laughs> I did get a few new things for my Our Generation collection, which I am obsessed with those dolls. I love them and I'm super, super happy. I think I shared the haul with you guys that I got on Instagram, but I haven't been sharing too much on Instagram because like I said, I've been totally wiped out. <coughs> Ooh, excuse me, did not want to do that on camera. Um, but um, like I said, I'm happy to be back. I wish I would have been back for the past two weeks and did two full weeks of shows. But things happen and I just was not able to do it. So I super, super apologize. But I will be doing a show tomorrow. Um, so stay tuned for that. Um... And then I'll, tomorrow I'll let you know about what is going to be the future. Uh, just to reiterate what I'm going to do with the channel going forward. 
So uh, thank you guys so much for tuning in today for this magical Monday. And I hope you enjoyed my um, little show and tell of the Hunchback of Notre Dame Funko Pops. You could get these probably wherever pops are sold. Um, and I hope you guys have a magical Monday and you're feeling well, feeling fine and having fun. Let's see if I remember how, how to do this. Remember to love your family, love your friends, but most importantly, love yourself. Be kind, stay positive, and until we meet again in this fabulous hunchback world, you guys have a magical day, and I will see you tomorrow for Tuesday's show and the last show of 2019. See you guys tomorrow. Bye-bye.